So, we just woke up. This is the view from our tent. Beautiful pink. Sunrise. Right, getting up, we're gonna try and make it down to Knife Lake today. And here is the scene this morning. Absolutely Gotta get going. Back to the campsite. This is the little trail here in the boutique. Just making breakfast. I was just heard a moose. And there's our breakfast. Pancakes with dehydrated strawberries in it and bacon. Dehydrated bacon. Which I've only tried the last couple of years, but I just cook it. Uh, pat out as much grease as I can. And then I dehydrate it in the dehydrator for a while and seal it up and it seems to work. I mean, I've been on two and three week trips and it seems to work just fine. Nice little treat. It's hard to leave. Such a beautiful campsite. Got a soda portage is right over here in the corner. Away from all the craziness. Falls Portage, and this is the fourth one. It's pretty cool. Beautiful falls. There's two falls over, one falls there, and two more around the corner. Anyway, it's 180, and we're off. Our next portage is over there. Okay. Yeah, that's a trail, isn't it? So yeah, I thought this was a 200, but it isn't. It's a 280. And we're going up. And there's how high up we came. Got a little bit of a steep climb, but other than that, should be okay. We're on Saginaw's now. And we're supposed to go straight up here.
Let's see if I will cut their way through here. So we just we just saw a couple of guys. We're saying that's two days in a row now we've seen people. Or three, three days in a row. Yeah. So. so this is supposed to be a 290. And I don't want to even think about the name of it till it's done. We just ran into two more guys. They said they came in from the east. So, not sure what that means. I actually got a soaker and we have water socks on in our boots and I think I have a leak. So it looks like a place from Middle Earth. It's pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> I crawl up those ones. I don't feel like um, <laughs> stepping up so high. It's too hard. Wow. Very beautiful. On our way after that portage. What was that? that was Dead Man's Portage that was called? Ugh. Ominous. High water. I'm sure this would be a lot easier, but we're going for another narrow, narrow, narrow. Shallow passage. Is that those guys? Yeah. Uh, Alrighty. I'll go up to the next one. We pulled over here for a little break. We're both getting hot. Yeah, it was like way too hot and I felt yeah, too um I, we both need oh, anyway, re lotion. Yeah, getting a little red here. Yeah. We'd rather portage today than sit out on the big water. We've done enough of that the last couple of days. Yesterday was really hard. Leaving Saginaw. Saginaw's. And that's where we had to come in for our 500 meter portage. And that's where we're going into Lily Pond Lake. Lily Pond. Let's hope it's a lake and not a swamp. <sighs> Okay, and off we go. So, we're kind of hoping to do it in one go. I don't know. We'll see. It's a swampy forest. It's a lot of bugs. So, I'm going to go this side. Because it's up a little higher. I don't know how often this portage is used. We decided to go here. It's a nice break from the heat on the lake. Okay. We are on Lily Pond Lake. There's a campsite there. And one way down there in the corner that we have to go past to the Narrows to, it's supposed to be a put over, so we don't know how long it'll be. But nice, cute lake. Oh, yeah. Now leaving Lily Pond Lake. And we're headed to Jasper and it's supposed to be a put in, which shouldn't be long. So we shall see. And I'll move out of the side and let Brent go. And on a sad note, I've left my stick on the other side of Lily Pond and will not be going back to get it. It was a nice beaver stick, but I'll get a new one. And this is Jasper Lake.
So we're just paddling through Jasper Lake. Just did the portage in here from Lily Pond Lake. I keep calling it Lily Pad Lake. So here we are at the end of the lake. And down the portage. So this is the 600 from Jasper into Otter Track Lake. We're hoping it's not too crazy. Okay, nice creek beside it. Thought we were done. I was hoping we were done, but obviously we're not. And there's a blaze there so this place is the put-in it's muddy but whatever it's the put-in and the trail stops we went up a little ways but it stops here so we're in otter track rocky ridge oh that breeze feels nice Huge cliffs over there. So, right across from us is the U.S. We made it all the way down. So we're on Otterback Lake. Across there is the United States. How many? Of you, we saw 31 people. 33. Today? 33 people. And two were Canadian. Two were Canadian. Yeah. So 31 people. 31 Americans first, today. And we only went what two? So sure, there's some lake trails. It's a beautiful lake. It's uh, crystal clear. And, and we're just sitting down here cooling off. We had a swim. Had two. Two swims. And it was just, oh my God, it was hot again today. Yeah, 27. 27, yeah. Yep. So tomorrow, we'll see what happens. If we do what we want to do, it'll be the biggest day we've ever done. But once we get into Knife Lake, it's just a straight paddle for almost 20 kilometers. So we'll see how it goes.